Hello. You know, I kind of find it really fascinating how we're able to order something digitally and then it'll just arrive at our house. We don't even have to step foot in a store. It'll just arrive in the mail. And now even though e-commerce has been around for a while now and it's practically the norm to order everything online, there are still a lot of mishaps that happen in the mail. There's been a lot of times actually where I've ordered something from Amazon and it never came. Or they say it got lost or it got ruined in transit or something like that. Even though I have Amazon Prime, which I pay for every year. I don't even know why. It's like not even making a difference. I don't even know why I have that. They're going to screw up and not give me my order. And there's also been a few times where we got our neighbor's mail. So there's been a few mishaps that's happened to me that aren't really that crazy. So I figure, let's take a look at the most insane things that people have received in the mail. In early 2018, someone tried to express mail a tiger cub. No, that has to be fake. They're sending a real live ant. No way. I'm getting ahead of myself here. But they're sending a... That... No. No way. That... And they barely, like, figured this out. Wait, wait, when did they figure this out? Let's see. Are they even in the airport still? Like, this looks like way later on. Yeah, this is outside. So does that mean they... TSA or whatever, they're, whatever... Right? They didn't look and inspect the tub and find out that there's a cub in there in the airport? They found out later on? How is that possible? Wouldn't you hear it like meowing or whatever like <laughs> in, the, in the airport? Like I don't understand this one. Tiger. It looks very upset. Like he got woke up from a nap. Inspectors found the sedated baby cat in a oh. sealed but ventilated Well, it's sedated, this way I didn't go crazy, The tiger still. was healthy, but a little dehydrated from- That's crazy. Look at that. <laughs> They're great. <laughs> Though the cub's ownership papers were in order, the shipping method was considered animal mistreatment. It was placed in the care of an animal rescue center. It's something that Tiger Woods- ti Tiger Woods? <laughs> It's something that Tiger King would do. <laughs> Tiger Woods. Him too. A man in Ohio got a letter in the mail. And then the same letter again. And again, and again, and again, 55,000 times. Oh. We were told Dan was shocked to see... Same mail? The company says it mistakenly sent the same letter over and over again. Are you kidding me? Oh, look at all these. Ew. The same letter over and over... I would die. But why would this guy wait until he has all of these stacks of piles of mail before you would even say anything? Don't you think if you got maybe one of these trays or boxes, you would say something? You would call him and be like, why aren't you sending me the same letter over and over again? But no, let, let, let's just wait until we have all these. <laughs> Derek Richardson got this pair of shoes from Amazon. They're ew, moldy. Ew. Yeah, they're not that bad. Someone returned a used waffle iron. Very used. It was resold dirty with waffle remains. Ew. Like, how could they even accept that, though? Don't the Amazon people look at the items when the people return them? And to say, like, okay, yeah, we could take it back. Like, or they just... Huh? They just take it without examining it? I don't get it. Why would they take this back? Hi, I'd like to return this burrito I ordered. <laughs> oh, it's not that anything was uncooked or there was mold or anything. I just didn't like it. Sir, this isn't a restaurant. But this is an Amazon Fresh store. Yeah, I know, but we don't make food. We just sell groceries. So I can't return it? No. Are you sure? Yes. <sighs> Was there anything else that you have that you want to actually return? Actually, yeah, I do. Oh, okay, great. What is it? I made this smoothie, but I actually didn't like it either. And this New Jersey mom got quite the special delivery. She ordered diapers online. What she got in the mail? Okay. Diapers. Used diapers. <clears throat> stuffed into this box. Needless to say, the mom was grossed out. Well, duh. Who wouldn't be grossed out? Ew. They sent her... They sent... Oh. They sent her used diapers with poop in them? Oh. 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 How could someone do that? This has to be like a prank. How could an actual store or an actual like person running a store or employees send her back used diapers? Like not one used diaper, like a package full. Packages ew, of used, like, don't you think after you put one used diaper in a box, you would see, hmm, oh, wait a minute. 
This feels all soggy and gross like there's wet poop in it. Yeah, it's probably used. But no, they just kept on packing more and more and more and more and more. And more. Oh, that, oh, that grosses me out so bad. Mom was grossed out. I feel so bad Whoever for her. Whoever decided to maliciously take the time to do this, I can't believe they did it just for 20 dollars $40. Exactly. Like, someone had to, like, maliciously do that just to be, like, a butthole. Like, that's not cool. Amazon says it. Bro, that was Amazon? So an employee did that at Amazon. Wow. I order from Amazon all the time. I think Amazon's the greatest. No one's ever done that to me. I've just had things arrive late or things that got lost and never came. But I never had like gross, wet, soiled caca diapers come in the mail. Customers to address the issues. Dude, shoes with throw up on them. The waffle maker that had waffle crust in it and caca diapers. What is wrong with these people? In another bit of quirkiness, check out this big package. Podcaster Jason Howell got an enormous box. Okay. This box. I don't know who you are, but. Has this package. <laughs> That's actually kind of funny. I wouldn't be, well, yeah, I actually would be upset if it ordered something and it didn't come. And instead, like a big box with just one package of Oreos came. But like, if I didn't order anything and this was just like a surprise gift or a surprise package, and this came, I would be laughing hysterically. At least they're not like rotten. Yet. Pete Sanderson got this Amazon package after ordering some dog toys. Can you come and look inside this box, please? <laughs> Seriously? I mean, I went out and had to buy this. I think that's cool. Like, I would want this big box. Maybe you could be shipped off with a baby tiger in there too. We've all become accustomed to receiving our packages in lightning speed. And so when packages are being packed that quickly, there are bound to be mistakes. And uh, I don't buy that still. Because yes, they're being packaged quickly, but it's not like no one's checking them at all. They have to be checked before they could go and be sent off. So they're okay or not. They're not like deadly. There's a bomb or a gun or something like, so they are checked. So yes, it, they could do a, they could, no, they could do a better job. Let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, they, I mean, they're all coming down pretty fast, but like, I don't think the employees just stand by this conveyor belt and be like, What'd you do today, Bob? Oh, you know, just hung out, ate some tacos, you know, the usual. Nice, nice. Yeah, me too. Mm hmm. I was just chilling, hanging out, you know, eating candy, the usual. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Almost closing time. Yeah. Almost closing time. A Las Vegas man decided to get back at some suspected porch pirates. So porch he pirate? a box with dog poop. <laughs> Heck yeah. Cleaning up the poop and putting it in a box, and that's what I did. Eric Burdo put the special delivery on his porch, and four days later, someone took it. We can only imagine their surprise when they opened it. <laughs> that's what he gets. <clears throat> Why do people feel the need to steal other people's packages? Like, that's so not cool. I think what we could take away from this video is don't steal other people's packages. If your package is really huge and gigantic, then there might be a sleeping tiger in there. And if your package smells really bad, run. Bye.